Team of the season, Jao Pedro has been added to weekly objectives, a 92 rated card with good stats, definitely deserved for his amazing season, fourth top goal scorer in the Serie A and in this video we're going to be taking a look, does the card look worth it and also how to complete the objectives as soon as possible. So just before we get into it, if you are new here, make sure that you do subscribe, we are going to be making lots more videos just like this one, daily team of the season in videos and every single time there is going to be a weekly objective we are going to be doing a guide just like this so definitely make sure that you are subscribed so you do not miss any of those future videos so getting straight into this one now first of all is he worth it always if you have a team where he could potentially fit in so for example this time round either Serie A or a full Brazilian team his stats are pretty decent and good so I definitely recommend going ahead and completing him high medium work rates and four star skill moves and weak foot it is very good and the balance is a little bit low which is the downside but with an engine ken style that can pretty much take care of it will take up to 86 balance and in game he is actually shown on footbin as a 97 rated cam or center forward that is very good for a free card of course you're not really going to get anything better than that that is what we've recently been getting with Sabitza also that Regulon it's very good if you have a team Serie A or Brazilian you could definitely put this in there but if not maybe as a super sub or definitely at least SBC fodder there's loads of guaranteed SBCs coming up for the league one or even the Serie A that is going to be now even ultimate team of the season definitely make sure you are stocking up on the high rated cards so this could potentially help so let's take a look now how to complete the objectives Samba Spearhead scored two goals in two separate rival matches using Brazilian forwards with at least six Serie A players in your starting squad so this is going to be very easy Easy. just have a full Serie A squad and you do need to be scoring two goals of course using a Brazilian forward so you can use Santos or if you convert Douglas Costa to a left wing with consumables it should count as a forward that is the only requirement of course that is a little bit dodgy but you could of course have him outside of the Serie A but it's just going to be easier if he is in the Serie A for squad building purposes so bright Brazilian the next one score a Finesco in three separate rival matches using Brazilians this is going to be very similar to to the first one when you are doing the first one just make sure one of the two goals is going to be a finesse shot so if you are doing it with Douglas Costa score a finesse and score a normal one and that is going to be the first and second one ticked off in one game then the next one is going to be a skillful setup assist with a through ball in four separate rival matches using players with minimum four star skill moves you can use Allen, Rebic, Lozano or that Douglas Costa once again and you are just going to have to be assisting with a through ball all you going to have to be doing this is four separate rival matches so you might have to do it a while with the last one which is clinical in Cagliari score and assist in eight separate rival wins using Serie A plays with minimum four star weak foot so again you can be using Rebic or Lotaro Martinez now that is going to be a helpful card as we can see this is how I have set it up three plays in here of course but the rest just make sure you are going to be filling in with all of the Serie A cards that you do have already in your club you don't need to go out and buy any anyone unless you are in a really high division but for most of us that is not going to be a problem you do need to have at least six serious players in your squad for one of those objectives and also make sure you convert Douglas Costa to a left wing because I'm pretty sure you do need to do that and again for one of those objectives and in each rival games make sure you are going to be trying to score two goals with Douglas Costa remember one of them is going to be a finesse shot goal assist with a through ball using Costa, Rebic or Lotaro Martinez any of these three that we we do already have here and then score and assist Rebic and Lotoro Martinez both apply for this and unfortunately that one is going to be quite long you need to do that eight rival wins so that is going to be quite lengthy but this time around EA have decided to make it eight separate rival wins so we are just going to have to go through it if we want to get this card let me know down in the comments below if you guys are going to be doing this and also if you need any other help then I can help you guys out yeah haven't really made this too difficult it is quite easy to explain and understand because of course there's not really too much they can be doing I guess with the Serie A just Brazilian and Serie A different weak foot skill moves so it's quite easy this one thank you guys for watching this video I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time